Hey guys, Tori here, and today we're going to start something new. It's going to be Man Crush Monday, where we're going to spend this entire video talking about one person's man crush worthy face. One of the guys that I've seen man crush the most is Ryan Gosling. So we're going to dedicate this whole video to the guys. If you don't know who Ryan Gosling is, then you've probably been living under a rock for a while. So let's get you up to speed. Mr. Gosling entered our lives when he became part of the cast of the new Mickey Mouse Club along with Justin Timberlake and Britney Spears and Christina Aguilera and all those other 90s teen pop sensations. Woo! I never really watched the Mickey Mouse Club, but he was there and adorable apparently, so I need to find it. But I think the point we all really started the man crush on Ryan Gosling was when he was cast in The Notebook. Who didn't fall in love with Ryan Gosling when he climbed up the Ferris wheel? And then being the king of grand gestures, he goes and renovates this house for them to live in forever. Everyone wants a grand gesture. <laughs> Everyone. After The Notebook, Mr. Gosling went off and did some other movies, but the stuff that really caught people's attention was his off-screen life, where he was breaking up fights and hanging out with his dog and going out with Rachel McAdams and then breaking up with Rachel McAdams and it's all a very exciting time. And then, if we weren't already in love with him, here comes Crazy Stupid Love. In Crazy Stupid Love, Ryan Gosling played a playboy for a while and then he took his shirt off for Emma Stone and nobody cared anymore. Nobody really had to say anything else that entire movie just get Ryan Gosling to keep his shirt off the entire time. I'm pretty sure we should get a law where Ryan Gosling just doesn't wear a shirt anymore. Ever. He went on to do The Ides of March with George Clooney and then Gangster Squad with Emma Stone again because apparently the producers were shipping Ryan Gosling and Emma Stone. Somewhere in this span of time after the notebook the internet kind of exploded with memes and so everywhere you look now there are hey girl memes and other stuff I don't run marathons but if I did the idea of Ryan Gosling waiting for me at the end would definitely be motivation to get me there Mr. Gosling is so charming that even Grumpy Cat loves him. We don't just love him because of his body. He's also got an interesting personality. Because of his Mickey Mouse Club past, he likes nothing more than spending the day at Disney World. Yes, man after my own heart. He loves animals like his adorable dog George. Ryan Gosling is so charming that he even makes dogs swoon. Who doesn't love Ryan Gosling? He's just great. Thanks for watching, you guys. I really enjoyed making a whole video just talking about Ryan Gosling's face. So if you enjoyed this too, give it a thumbs up and click the subscribe button. Thanks for watching, you guys. See you next time. I hurt my finger. That's why it's purple. I don't just have purple appendages. Do not fall in love with someone who climbs up a merry- not merry-go-round. What's that thing called? The, um, um... I'm just gonna keep saying Ryan Gosling. Ryan Gosling. Purple flanges. Ryan Gosling. If you don't know what a meme is, it's a silly little picture with stuff written on it, and I, I'm really not good at explaining memes. Okay, that's not happening. Is he Canadian? Am I imagining that? I, I think he might be. Ryan Gosling. Roses are red, violets are blue. I'm not good at poetry. Ryan Gosling, I man crush you, were face. This is Dog George. Probably doesn't say it with a British accent all the time. Although, after watching Harry Potter, why wouldn't you say it like that? After Crazy Stupid Love, Ryan Gosling went on to do it with just talking too fast. Ah. I'm sure this train of thought was going somewhere at first, and then it very quickly got off track and I'm not sure where I'm not sure why I'm still talking honestly